What's up you guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I've got a haul. Woo! Yes, I have a haul for you guys. Yes, I have been ordering some more clothes. I did say in my last haul that I probably would be, um, but I'm gonna start with what I'm raving about. Today I'm raving about the Postgrad podcast. So basically the Postgrad podcast is two young men um, in industry basically talking about their lives post-graduation. I've been listening to it since the onset but yeah if you need something good to listen to informative while still entertaining and getting kind of um a wider range of perspectives about post-grad courses i.e doing your masters or just life after university as well as during they've got some really really good episodes and some really good guests so that's what i'm raving about for today basically we've got a haul so it is a collective haul I did do a Q&A, a q and I did do a poll on Instagram asking you guys which one you wanted, whether that's a mini haul with my Zara items and then a separate one for my weekday or a collective haul. And you guys said a collective haul, so that's what you're gonna get. I hope nobody complains because that's actually what you don't ask for. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is gonna be a big one for once. By the way, if you hear birds chirping, that is normal for 5 a.m in England so <laughs> that might be why I thought I'd just get up because the early bird catches the worm and all that so yeah that will be the background noise but let's get straight into it I'm gonna start with the Zara items okay so item number one of my Zara order I'm starting with this one because it is the one that's a bit more different um, than the others as the others follow a trend you'll see when I show you but I got a dress um it's just a satin mini dress i don't know why guys but it's just got these very very thin straps okay it's longer than i thought it would be which is good um because if you watch my other hauls you know that i don't really do mini dresses um but yeah i just think it's gorgeous i got it in a size medium because i was scared that the small would not fit my bottom half and it cost me 15.99 i'm pretty sure it was in special price um but they have this and they have it in black and they have it in sage you know i was going to order both the black and the sage but i thought i'd try something that's a little bit different for me but the color is gorgeous i think i really like it okay this one is definitely more summer than spring and it definitely makes me look shapeless the waist is way too big but i should have known that getting a medium but not gonna lie like this would have been actually the material's quite stretchy i probably could have gotten away with getting a size small but i don't know man i just feel like here is it's hugging the hips <laughs> it's hugging the hips i'm not sure what i could do about this besides maybe getting the waist taken in but i do really love the pattern so yeah i don't know if i'm going to keep this one next up we have another knitted dress so if you watched my very first Zara haul you'll see that I got this in an ecru color but I really just felt like I needed it in a grey my girl Tyra she has it in the grey and I saw it on her and I was like mm. I knew she would get this one instead of the ecru one but we both agreed that we need both um so I picked it up I picked it up in the same size as last time so a size small and it cost 25.99 I'm pretty sure it was on sale so I do think it was cheaper than that but hey hey ho so the next item I got from Zara, you've probably seen on every fashionable sort of babe in the past few months. But I first decided I wanted to get it because when I went out with Makai, she was wearing it and I was like, yeah, I need this cardigan. I had seen it before, but I just didn't know how it would fit and I fell in love with it. Um, so after I ordered it, I saw that Lisa even posted it in her recent Zara haul, which means, I mean, if my mates agree, it's a yes that makes it a yeah so this is the cardigan and oh like it's just very pretty i got this in a size small and it costs 29.99 i can't remember what the sale prices are if there are sale prices but if i can find them i'll leave them in the description box but yeah i just love this cardigan so the final Zara item I was a bit conflicted about because it's not really me. Like it is me in that it's mono, so it's a beige and black. But I don't really do puff sleeves. But I thought I'd try it out. So it's this cute puff sleeve top. Um, basically this part is knitted. I'll get closer so I can show you the material. 
and then the sleeves are i believe cotton um but yeah i just think it's really really cute it is a crop from what i can see um and it looks like the top part is like quite straight over so like the top that i'm wearing now which is also from zara um but yeah i got it in a size medium and it costs 25.99 so seeing as that is it for the zara items we're now going to move on to the items that i got from weekday um, I don't know how much you guys shop at weekday, but I do like weekday quite a lot. So yeah, I'll show you the pieces I picked up. If you know me, you know for spring, summer, I love me a t-shirt and jeans combo, t-shirt and shorts, t-shirt and denim skirt and sliders. I do love to wear t-shirts, usually with some layered chains, hair looking nice, face beat, that type of stuff. Um, so I picked up three t-shirts from weekday basically it was like a three for two and i believe they were eight pounds each but they're just three basic t-shirts so i'll show you each one of them the first one i got in pink it's called the alanis t-shirt that is what it's called i think it's really really pretty and i like the color i got it in a size small because the model was wearing a small and the small looked like it would be the kind of size i was going for so not too oversized that it looks weird tucked in but not too um tight because if it's not a baby tee i don't understand why the t-shirt will be coming fitted in some places and not fitted in others and i tend to find that like with this t-shirt length if you don't get it a little bit oversized if you want to wear it over something it kind of lands on your bum in this awkward way that i'm not really here for um so yeah i got all of the t-shirts in a size small instead of an extra small so i'll just show you the next two so this is the one I got in the plain colour. This is a colour you'll be used to seeing in my hauls because it is one of the colours that I choose to wear. Black, beige, white. <laughs> very, very mono, very boring. But um, I think this would look so cute with a pair of like, light blue jeans. Like, yes, yes, yes. So this is the Alanis t-shirt in the plain colour. And finally, I got it in grey also because I mean, if you're gonna get three t-shirts, you may as well get a gray one. Um, I swear by gray tees, I feel like they work for every single season. So this is the third t-shirt, again, in a size small. The next item I got is a long sleeve top. I really fell in love with this when I saw it, so I just had to have it. It is called the Amy Long Sleeve, and I got it in a size small. It costs 18 pounds and this is it really it's just a high neck long sleeve with this like stitch detailing i thought this would be so cute it was giving me like bodysuit vibes wow look how long the arms are you know i'm here for that it was giving me bodysuit vibes um but i just thought this would look nice tucked into some jeans or some sort of pants um and yeah it's a cute color so i feel like it's like doable even though it's long sleeve it's like doable in other seasons which is why i thought mm, spring this gives me spring vibes but yeah oh i hope it fits because i really love it already <laughs> the next item i got i got literally because i couldn't resist the bargain it was originally 35 pounds and went down to 10 pounds i just had to have it didn't i it is called <laughs> um it's called the cindy crinkle velvet dress if you recognize the color and the pattern i do have the leggings in this color and in um a black but i just thought why not man why not just get a little dress that you might be able to wear if you ever get to go for cocktails with your friends again <laughs> um yeah i fancied the dress a little bit and i just thought 10 pounds for a cute dress if it bangs it bangs and if it doesn't i guess i can return it but yeah i thought this might look nice on it was a bit risky and it's not necessarily my style but I thought I would try it out anyway. <laughs> Fingers crossed, it doesn't look too bad. <laughs> okay, so the final item I've got here is possibly my favorite item of the bunch, because y'all know I love me some tie-dye and I love me some green, and I got both in one item. So initially, when I was on the weekday site, I saw leggings of these. My sister said they were a bit jazzy, but I don't take fashion advice from her therefore i was gonna get them but then i saw this jumpsuit i believe it was on sale if i recall correctly and i think it was about 12 pounds um down from 25 pounds originally it's called the lindy jersey jumpsuit but i just thought like come on man for summer this is cute 
I don't know, maybe like you guys won't like this one, but I really like it. I got it in a size medium because I didn't think that the bottom, um, I didn't think the bottom would fit in a small, but also it has adjustable straps. So I thought if the top part was coming loose at the very least, I could hold it up with the straps. So yeah, I'm pretty impressed by this. I hope it looks nice. If it looks nice on, it will be my favorite item but we will see, <laughs> we will see, oh my gosh, I really want to love this, like, I really, really, really want to love this, um, but I'll try it on for you guys so you can see. Okay, so I did breeze through that a lot quicker than I thought I would, um, but I hope you guys liked the items, this is the end of the haul. <laughs> I don't know when my next haul will be, I'm not gonna lie, because I think I've ordered enough Oh, I say that, but if I see something else that's cute, I probably will order it. I have ordered some skincare because since being stuck inside, my skin has been absolutely pants. Like, I can't even lie. It's so bad. Like, I've been getting a load of spots. Like, I've been really breaking out and the spots are scarring. So I don't particularly know what to do, but I'm looking at combating my skin in the next <laughs> few weeks. Um, other than that, stay inside kids. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please give us a thumbs up. If um, you like my content, subscribe. <laughs> You'll see more videos like this and a whole other bunch of things that I like to do. But in any case, I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.